Jeff from Graham. Say what's up, America? Half of you should know me, right? On the half a replica. Shout out to my, my homie. Shout out to that one dude. Oh, wait, fuck that. Ain't nobody help my ass out on this jump through. So where is Miss Feeder and today I present you another sick gameplay as the head commentator for Abstract. So yeah, I became the lead commentator for Abstract today, or yesterday when you're seeing this, and I'm so privileged to be a part of this team. Anyway, the gameplay is a 63 second Moab in a double Moab gameplay with the ACR 6.8 on the map terminal on Modern Warfare 3. I miss this game so much, especially in the prime time of COD where everyone I knew owned and played Modern Warfare 3. I miss these old days where there was a consistent run of good Call of Duties being released every year trying to outdo each other each and every year and causing crazy debate over which Call of Duty was the best. I wish those days of no supply drops or where every gun in the game was overpowered would come back. Then we would start having that cycle of Call of Duty is outdoing each other back. I mean, imagine having similar years to what we had before. Obviously, that's probably not possible with the way COD is going at the moment as they went through the jetpack route, but even though it's back to boots on the ground, in my opinion, it just doesn't have the same drives those previous Call of Duty, which is why I have my hopes up for the current Call of Duty coming up as it's Treyarch. I mean, think of what they've done in the past. They've made World at War, which was an amazing World War game. They made Black Ops 1, which was also alright, and Zombies was amazing and Black Ops 2, which was amazing also, and Black Ops 3, even though it was a jetpack, it was very enjoyable. I mean, I enjoyed it. So surely they should bring out another amazing Call of Duty this year, and since it's back on boots on the ground, you could argue that the pressure is now on them to make a better boots on the ground game than Sledgehammer. But yeah, I have faith in this year's Call of Duty, and I hope that it will turn out similar to the old CODs, like Modern Warfare 3, and have the same motivating factor to level up on it, as for me, today's CODs don't have that same feel to it, and it gets boring really quickly. I kind of went off on the rim there, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's commentary. Abstract Wilds' link will be in the description. I heavily advise you check him out for more amazing gameplays just like this one. If you want to hear more from me then my link will be down in the description as well. Please like the video as it helps us out a lot and subscribe and press the notification bell if you haven't already to never miss an upload. I'm going to leave you with the rest of the gameplay and yeah, I'm Mr. Feed signing out. Peace. mistakes too but that doesn't excuse what you do you always play me then betray me like it's nothing to you all my life i've only ever opened up to a few turning the page you can never act your own age make up more lies than the makeup on your face you drink and drink and drink and drink until they grab on your waist how the fuck you say you love me that was never the case right Call me in to set me free the sand can't reach my never the case right